inside sports i kenya kama kawaida this is how we do it na hivi leo nimekita kambi nimetembelea mwisho wa kenya huko hivyo 254 pande za wislin moran na nikitaja wislin moran tunajua shughuli ni moja tu big boys of course chilling with big machines and right now nina jamaa hapa hivi anazinga la machine by the way kwanza kabisa i introduce to manager nani na haswa kabisa hili ni zinga gani ambalo yeye mwenyewe analiendesha hello hello hi 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 how are you i'm fine thank you isa how are you feeling? Leo. The, the environment, the enthusiasm, it's, it's amazing. It's amazing. Yeah. Kwa mtu kwanza, hajawahi kuona, anakuona, mara ya kwanza ndani ya sports time. Mwambe unaitwa nani na hasa unafanya nini? Ah, uh, Renson Washira kwa majina. Na kuaga mechatronics engineer. What? Mechatronics engineer. Mechatronics. Yeah. That's new. So that's, so that's mechanical engineering plus electrical engineering. Uh -huh plus electrical and uh, computer science. Wow, 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 amazing, amazing. Mina una uzungu, una, una nisha zinga la machine, amalo ni tofauti sana. Nieleza tu kwanza hii ni bike gani, and why exactly is it this way? This is a custom bike. Um, I've always been interested in bikes, but kwanga levy market, we've not been seeing something different, you know? Something unique, something that is not out there already. So, kakachini with my team of designers, kajaribu kufikiria what you can do. So we came up with this concept of the Big Five Rugged. Big Five? Big Five Rugged. Yeah. So it's like we're trying to um, incorporate the, the facts and the beauties of, of our country that are not normally um, appreciated by most people, you know. So if, if you're into the Big Five, I think anybody can really relate to it. Be it the elephant, unonakama like migu, ni trade ambayo ineza shike, ineza tembea mahali kupote. Kwa sandi ocean. Inaenda kabisa, inapita kupita. Ikuwe ni inji, nuseme power yake, kama ile chita, ni kitu ambavu ili nakimbia. Kwa hivu ni features ambavu kiangalia hapa na pale, ina represent the, the big five ambayo tuko now in our country and also in, in Africa. As well. Wow, wow, amazing. Napenda ya concussion the big five animals, and of course ume leta hadi kwa bikes. Yani, bikes too manze, siyo nduthi, siyo kurace bikes too, sindi yo. You know, if, if you want to go out there like kwa... Um, to visit the wild, you know, you need something that can be able to handle that terrain properly. Like, um, you need something that can be able to handle terrain and bio bikes are quite a magari za kawaida pia na kuta sa zingine has your zani kufika. Ya kuja hawa peki yake, ame kuja na the whole family. So, kuja kuja dadi, nda muta dadi, hello, hi, hi. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, you don't want to handshake. I don't want to handshake. Uko poa? Kapisa. Una feel like you kuleta mtoi ya pa hivikuwa? Uh, it feel staging for the first time since he went to school since he been to college this is the first time he's able to showcase what is in him and in the family i personally am a born designer he is trying to come out with everything that i've ever desired to do anything i wish to do i did with the sticks i did with the wires i made small things but now he has come up now to bring the tangible thing i see myself through him Wow, I know, I know, I know getting this, the, this stuff, like the equipment, right. the armor, what, it's very, very expensive. Very expensive. How exactly do you support him to get those equipment? One thing I know and I can tell, you don't have to have money all the time. But there's something you have that you can make use of it. That engine, I was using it for painting, uh, as my compressor for painting. I gave the, the compressor so that he can get out the engine. I gave, I mean the tool division, paint and tool division, I've given them the toolbox worth about uh, 50,000, which has 147 pieces that he can use every part of it to make what he wants. Wow. Yes. Wow. Isn't this beautiful and amazing? Even you lose it, when you know it's a customized bike, so he bike initially. He had a sick one. 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 So you umetengeneza bike kwa mwenyewe basi. Chuma moja moja unashikanisha chuma mpaka inakuwa inakuwa bike. Wow, amazing. Mimi nataka kukupata chance nishikie tu mic. Then upande hapa juu unieleze step to wires na everything kwa bike yako. Sawa sawa. So at the back here is where we have uh, the big wheel. This 5 510 by 8 representative of the elephant, you know. Um, elephants are very strong, they're very durable. Um, in the sense that ikikanyaga chini sio mguu yake itaisha you know uh, the speed the agility of this 
It's amazing. It's amazing. It's a machine that has been built to be able to go anywhere. Kama ni kule msituni kule ama mahali kuna kuna mavali sivi mahali ambavyo wezi to share tu hivi kawaida kawaida kwa means ya kawaida. This should be able to this should be able to take you. We are also promoting um, anything to do with uh, preserving uh, our animals and conserving nature because that is a theme that has been long uh, long neglected and really think it's about time we, we, we bring some attention to to actually taking care of our environment and nature as a whole so if you love visiting environments that are just fulfilled with nature if you just love anything to do with the big five animals if you just love um, just having a good time having an adventurous time we can always think about something where we can do you know locally um, being able to make even our own means of transport come on bikes come on easy kitu ambayo inaweza kutembeza ufike mahali pale na pia in the process pia we can be able to we, we are open to charities and and such forums that can be able to help us at least push be able to be able to push this this initiative forward because there's a lot we can do as a country there's a lot we can do um, we don't really have to import everything all the time i mean if we we have the knowledge and we have the know-how and we do have the resources if you ask me to be able to build it and everything that we want technology wise we're not really behind as a country i think there's a lot we can do so this is just the beginning um, if we move forward to the engine this was formerly a compressor engine a generator um, most people know it to just spray paint or car wash or just anything to do with air pumping air but this time round we are we're reinventing it or we're kind of twisting the idea of the wheel a little bit and being able to come up with something a little bit different so here we are using the generator to actually run a bike which is still in concept form it's supposed to be hybrid um, so that means very soon we are gonna have to figure out how to change this drivetrain as you can see it's 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 habit hanging right now because it's still a, a a progress a progress like in motion so anytime anything can just change but we're really hopeful for a future that is a bit more um, caring to our environment if I may say so so that's why we're thinking about anything to do with electric um, hybrid I think that is the way we should be able to go right now as a country renewable energy I mean there's too much pollution if we start talking about pollution it's it's just a whole sad load but I think there's a lot we can do so with this kind of publicity and and this kind of interest where we can be able to get such kind of forums where we get a lot of enthusiasts could be big bikes or cars I'm sure there's a way we can be able to fill it in and just bring a good message out of all this and out of all the exposure that comes out of this so everything here is built from scratch this is 16 gauge metal very heavy metal um, and the total weight of the bike comes around 98.4 kilos so that brings it around the average weight of a dirt bike so durability wise and, and weight wise we have done all the math and um, we're, we're heading somewhere we're heading somewhere so I, I think this can just be a polite humble call out to anybody out there who's thinking about doing something different anybody who's thinking about um, coming out with a new creative way to be able to just get the message out there to make our uh, promote our country in any given way be it taking care of our environment be it taking care of, of, of um, our animals whatever it is I mean there's a lot we can do whatever it is you're interested in as a person I'm sure the next person can also have something they can relate to that and we can always come up with positive things that are not just to do with um, having fun you know we can also save and conserve other things in the process